What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying, just saying, saying. Um, this is Daily Tea Time. Daily Tea Time, Daily Tea Time, Daily Tea Time, Daily Tea Time. Just saying. Um, hope everybody is doing well. I'm doing it pre recorded, and I told you guys that I was going to do that a couple days ago. It's a little blurry. What's up with that? Um, I told you guys I was going to go pre-recorded, uh, a couple days ago, a few days ago, something like that. Um, I, I just feel guided to do that now, um, more often, so I'm going to, um, just saying, just saying. So, it's pre-recorded, Daily Tea. It's for January 27th of 2022. I hope everybody is doing fantastical. Um, I did get a channel message in, so we're going to roll with it. Um, I, um, I really, really consorted, I was going to tell you guys real quick before we get into it, I really, really consorted with the spiritual realm last night, because I really want to start doing sign readings again when I'm able to, um, and, um, I meditated on it, and I didn't really get, like, a full, clear reply back, um, but I did hear um, can do short readings. So I'm going to do short readings. Um, if we get any downloads in, I'll share them. If I don't, I don't just like I normally do. But, um, so I guess I'll do like some mini S type readings for you guys for the signs. Um, I do miss doing the sign readings, but if, um, you guys notice that anybody else is stealing my material on somebody else's channel, please let me know. Just saying, just saying my material is copyrighted. So, uh, just, just so you know. Okay, so, um, so yeah. So the channel message I received was, um, uh, someone that once slandered, uh, um, I heard a nurse, a nurse's occupation and, um, accused them of being a drug diverter. It's about to backfire on them in a huge way. They are the real drug, di drug diverter. That's what I heard. I mean, that's that's pretty some strong shiznit right there. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. So, um, and this is all about a nurse in here today. Um, I have pulled nurse energy in here before, um, from time to time. Not not strong nurse energy. I know I have a lot of nurses on my um, on my channel, like subs. I have a lot of nurses as subs. I have a lot of medical professionals as subs. Um, period, um, on my channel. I know I do, but, um, I specifically heard nurse. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So someone that once accused, you could be the one they accused of being a drug diverter, or you could know somebody that accused this person of being a drug diverter, or you can know the person that really is the real drug diverter. However, that plugs in your life. Um, however, that plugs in. I had to look up the term drug diverter um, the other day, actually, um, I'm going to re-look it up per Google and then I'll read it out. So for people that doesn't know, that do not, is not familiar with the term drug diverter, that way you know what it is and everybody's on the same page here. Well, my phone would go slow as Christmas, just saying, just saying. Um, so yeah, so someone that once accused someone, they basically slandered their name and said they were a drug diverter. They accused them of being a drug diverter. Um, but it, it sounds like they're not, they're not the real drug diverter. It, the, it sounds like the person that is accused this person of being the drug diverter, they are. Now, the person that's being accused of a drug, being a drug diverter, I heard they're a nurse. So... I wonder if the person that is accusing them of being a drug diverter is a nurse. I didn't hear that part, but maybe you plug it in how it resonates. Hold on a second. Okay, so when prescription medicines are obtained or 
When prescription medicines are obtained or used illegally, it is called drug diversion. Healthcare providers who steal prescription medicines or controlled substances such as opioids for their own use put patients at risk. So basically, okay, I heard the person that they accused of being a drug diverter is a nurse. So, you know, nurses, now whether this person is an LPN, LVN, RN, or um, nurse practitioner, or nurse anesthesiologist, or what have you, they are a nurse. Um, now, nurses can, I mean, they obtain access to opioids or other um, narcotics or other medicines, period. That is part of their, their job description is um, access in medicines to treat patients, basically. Um, so they have access to medicines, especially narcotics. Um, just saying, just saying. So, um, so somebody accuses someone, a nurse, of being a drug diverter, basically. Um, and, but I heard it's about the backbone on them because the person that has accused his nurse of being a drug diverter, I heard they are the real drug, di drug diverter. Um, so I wonder if the person that accused this person of being a drug diverter is a nurse or a medical professional. Um, I didn't hear, I didn't hear that they were. Um, but drug diversion basically is, um, obtaining illegal prescriptions or illegal, um, or obtaining someone else's medicines and if the this person in this specific story and scenario is a nurse they obtain it from the workplace situation um they accuse them of doing this to but they're not the real drug diverter it's the person that is accused this person of being a drug diverter is the real drug drug diverter if that makes sense dear god I'm, have good this is crazy i mean it's well it's not crazy well it is crazy it is crazy um, it's crazy. It is crazy. Straight up crazy. All right. Wake up call. We got wake up call. I shuffled them. We got wake up call. Yeah, I know I'm doing daily tea on my son's bed. Just let y'all know. If y'all, I know y'all probably were like, where the crap is she? Just saying, just saying. I'm not in the spirit room today. Um, I'm on a bulk bed. Just saying. Okay. So wake up call. Someone's getting a huge, 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 huge wake-up call. Huge. Huge. Okay, I heard someone's getting a huge, huge wake-up call. Huge. So someone's getting a huge wake-up call. Maybe, I think one of you guys knows this person, the real drug diverter. Because they have accused somebody, a nurse, of being a drug diverter. Now, whether they're a nurse, whether they're med, I feel they might be a nurse or a medical professional themselves. That's what I'm feeling. Why? Because they're accusing this nurse of being the drug, of a, being a drug diverter. But there's a reason they're accusing this nurse of being a drug diverter. We have to think about it logically here. There's a reason they're accusing them of being a drug diverter. So maybe that's where the wake up call is coming in. Maybe you're having the wake-up call about this. I think one of you guys knows the real drug diverter. One person most certainly knows the drug diverter personally. They're about to get a huge, huge, huge wake-up call. One person in the medical professional community, one person... In law enforcement community, one person in legal community. Oh, shoot. Whoa. Okay. Holy crap. Well, at least three of you people, three of you guys know the real drug diverter, um, apparently. So they're accusing this poor nurse of being a drug diverter. But I heard this nurse is not the drug diverter. Um, the one that's being accused of being, either they are currently being accused of being a drug diverter or in the past, maybe they people, they were slandering um, the, his or her name across the community saying um, they were a drug diverter. I'm thinking they were slandering this nurse's name across the community saying they were a drug diverter so no one would hire them in the proper position. However, many things have changed and they're going to continue to change. Oh, my
my god whoa so you plug it in how it resonates oh my god oh this is so deep so okay so truth's coming out so i heard they um whoever the real drug diverter is i heard they um slandered the nurse's name across the community so the physical community wherever this nurse lives whatever however the story plays in your life millions and billions of people in the world so you have to play in your life how it fits but whatever community this is, this nurse resides in, and only you know your story, not anybody else. So either you plug in or you don't, um, however you plug in. But they slandered this nurse's name across the community saying um, he or she was a drug diverter. I heard so no one would hire them in the proper position, um, which is strategic reasoning um, for them not to, you know, they didn't want the drug... Um, that nurse to be hired in the proper position for a reason to make their case of more of why um to to try to prove they're a drug diverter basically is what i'm feeling from this but you plug it in how it resonates but however that resonates um i heard three of you guys know this drug the real drug diverter so you know the real drug diverter whoever the person is um and they are very 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 wealthy And very smart. And very cunning. Oh, God. And I heard they're very wealthy and they're very smart and they're very cunning. So the real drug diverter is very wealthy, very smart, and very cunning. So um, the real drug, drug diverter is very smart, very wealthy, and very cunning. Well, um, just saying, just saying. So it's holy god okay so one of you guys works in the legal community and you know this very smart wealthy and cunning drug diverter you work in the legal community one of you guys works in the medical professional community and you know this drug diverter very smart wealthy and cunning drug diverter and one um when you work in the medical community when you work in uh legal what was the and one you work in law enforcement and you know this drug diverter and they're very smart wealthy and cunning so you plug it in how it resonates. Um, however, how that resonates. Ow. Um, I just, oh my God, this is, ooh, this is something. The real drug diverter is a position of high authority. Oh my God. Okay, I heard the real drug diverter is a position of high authority. So the real drug diverter is a position of high authority is what I heard. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, they're very wealthy, smart, and cunning. So, I mean, they know what the hell they're doing. Now, I didn't hear what specific occupation they are, um, but they're a position of high authority in some shape, form, or fashion. But they're very smart, wealthy, and cunning. Um, now, usually drug diverters, um, from my knowledge, when I look the information up on drug di drug diverters and drug diversion and all this crap, um, they, they usually don't work in position of high authorities, um, just for anybody who doesn't know that, for a little knowledge. Drug diverters do not usually work in positions of high authority to try to mask their cover. Um, but this drug diverter apparently has slandered a nurse's name across the community to try to get them hired in positions that not a high authority and put in their not their correct positions to make them like the drug diverter. But in reality, they're the real drug diverter. Um, and they're a position of high authority. I think in this community that um, basically that they were relying on this, um, relying on this nurse about. This is crazy. Oh, someone is getting such a huge wake up call. Okay. Oh my God. I heard someone's getting such a huge wake up call and we got wake up call again. Oh, earth sign energy heavy. Earth sign energy heavy. So earth sign energy heavy, um, getting a huge wake up call. So, earth sign energy heavy, getting a huge wake-up call. I think maybe you know the drug diverter, earth sign. 
choice cup one Virgo, I think you know the drug, drug diverter. Or maybe you are the drug diverter or you know the drug diverter or you're related to the drug, drug diverter or you work under the drug di diverter because I heard um, the drug diverter is a position of high authority. I strongly feel this drug diverter is works in the medical um, professional field as well. Now, I didn't hear they did, but they, ha they have access to uh, medicines um, and I feel it's narcotic opioids opioid type medicine narcotics i mean i'm just saying just saying they have access to um some high-end substances just saying just saying bro bro Ooh. all right we have beginnings on the bottom of the deck but I heard, um, basically, you know, they're trying to screw this nurse over in this community. They're trying to screw uh, him or her. They're trying to screw him or her over. Um, I heard they were basically slandering this nurse's name around the community, trying not to get him hired in positions of high authority to, you know, solidify one of the, you know, trying to help their case with saying, you know, oh, well, they're the drug diver, blasey, blasey, blasey. Um, but it's about to backfire in such a huge way. Okay, I heard, but it's about to backfire in such a huge way. Um, so they're tr they've been trying. It sounds like they've been trying, 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 trying. It sounds like it's been effective. It sounds like it's been effective, and um, uh, his, it has been effective for a long time. But people are getting huge wake up calls. Okay, I heard it's been effective for a long time, but people are getting huge wake up calls. So it's been effective for a long time. Um, preventing this nurse from, I guess, their destiny and living out, you know, um, positions or, or places or what have you they're supposed to be and doing things they're supposed to do and, and being in positions they're supposed to be in and blasey, blasey, blasey. But, um, but I heard it's about to backfire. So it sounds like karma is about to come around for them in a negative sense because people are, I think you guys are getting huge wake up calls. And at least three of you guys personally know this drug diverter. At least three of you do. One, you, uh, and you have to plug yourself in where you fit. One, you work in medical professional community. One, you work in legal, legal community. One, you work in um, law enforcement community. And you personally know this drug diverter in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, position of high authority drug, drug diverter. Which, like I said, when I research drug diversion, they don't usually work in positions of high authority to try to um, uh, to try to cover up their cover, basically. Um, but this person does. It's like they're hiding out in plain sight. Um, but they have slandered this uh, this nurse, saying they're the they're the, they're the drug diverter, and they're really not. I strongly feel this position of authority might be a nurse. I didn't hear they were. They might be, or work in the medical professional community in some shape, form, or fashion. So beginnings. Many series of train events are about to occur. Someone's about to start doing some huge research on internet searches, computer searches, and documentation. And someone's about to really, really start search, um, Watching cameras heavily in a public situation, workplace. Oh, Lord. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So I heard about to backfire in a huge way, and someone's about to um, start work watching um, cameras very heavily in a workplace situation. Um, maybe one of you guys, I think one of you guys. Is getting the huge wake-up call. I think you know who the real drug diverter is. Now, whether you um, has suspected this person was, or maybe you're going to report it, or um, or now you're figuring out who the real one is, I'm not sure. Everybody's on different time of life paths. But however that resonates, 
Um, I think you're about to get a huge, you either have gotten a huge wake-up call of who the real drug diverter is, or you're about to. Um, I think one of you guys might work in corporate, um, because I heard cameras are about to really, really, or you might be a manager, boss, CEO, supervisor, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, because I heard somebody's about to start really watching, um, watching cameras very, very heavy in a workplace situation. I'm thinking a medical professional workplace situation on this position, a high authority, real drug diverter is what I'm feeling. And I heard you're going to start somebody, at least one of you guys is going to start searching, um, really start searching, um, internet searches and, um, uh, internet activity. Um, in this public space, I'm thinking as medical professionals of space on this position, a high authority drug diverter, the real one. Um, that's exactly what I'm feeling. So new beginnings, you're about to really start amping it up. You're about to learn a lot. Know this. Very prominent company this person works for. Oh my God. Whoa. I heard you're about to learn a not, uh, I can't speak. You're about to learn, a, learn a lot. Know this, um, very prominent position of high authority. I mean, not prominent position of high authority, prominent company this person works for. So this position of high authority, real drug diverter, they work for a very prominent company. Um, possible healthcare is what I'm feeling, but it, it doesn't have to be, but there's a way they're get there way there. There's a, way they're accessing these drugs and they're accessing them from a um public space like a um workplace or they have connections maybe their spouse accesses them accesses them for them or a family member or a lover accesses them for them but there's a way these drugs are being accessed they have a connection either they physically access them themselves if their position of authority um, they are physically accessing themselves or they still some, or they've been trying to steal someone's password to access them, um, possibly, but there's a way they're accessing them or manipulating someone to access, access them. However, that resonates. Um, but I heard you're going to really, really start watching who, one of you guys, at least three of you guys know the person, but. Of course, you have to plug yourself in where you fit. But one of you guys is going to start watching this person very heavily on cameras. Cameras in a works, workspace situation. This position on high authority, drug, real drug diverter. Um, and I heard you're going to learn a lot. Um, some kind of internet search activity. Um, some kind of documentation activity. And that's what makes me think medical professional um, occupation too. But it could be anything with documentation. Documentation is legal. Documentation is law enforcement. Documentation is medical professional. So that really could span any of that, to be honest. But, um, but this is serious. This is serious. I, I'm, I'm feeling strong medical professional, um, energy here, but it doesn't necessarily have to be. You plug it in, how it resonates. Oh Lord. All right. Let me see if I hear anything else. Okay, didn't. Oh my God. What? Somebody. Many shocking series of chain events are about to occur with this. An admission from someone in this person's workplace soon is about to blow this all to hell. Oh my God. I heard many shocking series of chain events are about to occur with this and a um, shocking omission from someone in this position, a high authority, real drug diverters workplace is about to blow it, blow it all to hell. So blow this real drug diverters cover all to hell, basically, um, is what I'm feeling. Um, it might be more than one person with an omission soon. Definitely one person. It might be more than one. Okay, I heard definitely more, uh, definitely one person. It might be more than one person, but it's somebody that works in this real drug diverters workplace. So maybe you are going to, um, maybe it's you um, that's going to, uh, 
come forward. Come forward and relay some information. You know this person is the real drug diverter and you're going to relay it, possibly, is what I'm feeling. Because I heard a shocking series of chain events admission from at least one person. It might be more than one person sued. Um, maybe it's you, possibly. You plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates for you. All right, you guys, we're done. I love you guys so freaking much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.